what the ladies talking about. What's up, family? Dio Hughley says Donald Trump, your president, is well on his way to losing yet another election, and he will take the Republican Party down with him in the process. I wholeheartedly agree. Dio Hughley made these comments as he was at LAX. And this was right before, just a few hours before, Cheeto Man stepped up to the mic to announce his much anticipated run for the 2024 presidential election. Now, as you know, Trump got his head busted wide open to the white meat in the last election, and he tried to lie and deny do saying things like the election was rigged. Let me tell you how Trump get out. Some of y'all already know this, but let me just remind you if you don't. Trump, the way he operates, whatever he accused someone else of doing, that's what he's doing or plans to do. This is how they take your eye off the ball. If I can say that these guys are cheating, even if they're not cheating, and if I lose, I got my eye already because I already set it up. And if I win, then I just won because I'm just the better candidate. You see, that's how they get down. That's how Trump get down specifically. DL also clowned Trump for seeing almost all of his hand-picked candidates go down in flames in the midterms and for losing the popular vote in the last two elections. It was beautiful to see, fam. I ain't going to lie. I thought they had a much better chance. But that just goes to show you how crippling a Trump endorsement is. Trump is a liability. And the Republicans are so slow that they don't even know. Reminds me of the Democrats. But that's what we are now, fam. They're so slow that all they had to do is just run somebody that was kind of likable. And they could have slammed up. I do believe they would have slammed up the midterms. But because they continue to point as Trump, point to Trump as their leader, people are like, oh, hell no, we can't let them in. You know, that's going to give him more power in the general. And it's going to be a wrap when, 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 in, in, in two years. He, he's going to be right back in office. Trump is a liability. And a lot of people was not going to even vote in the midterms. They wasn't even going to vote in 2024. But now Trump has galvanized the opposition and people are going to go right back to the polls and record numbers because the cry once again is going to be anybody but Trump, anybody but Trump. That's right. Anybody, even Joe Biden with his raggedy ass, anybody but Trump. That's what y'all's going to be sick about. I know y'all in the comments, right? Joe Biden, Joe Biden, Joe Biden, Joe Biden. I already know all of that. Anybody but Trump. Yeah, man. Anybody but him. Now, BL compared Trump and DeSantis, or Ron DeSantis, pretty much as being the same person. He said that Ron DeSantis is just a younger version of Trump. Ron DeSantis is, as you know, the governor of Florida. DL did give the Republicans a slither of hope when he said there's only one way that Trump could lose the Republican nomination. Anybody know the answer? I'll give you a few moments to think about it. Okay, time's up. He said the only way 
that Trump can lose the Republican nomination is if he's indicted and goes to jail. I concur. That's the only way because the Republicans are full of cowards. See, a lot of people think they hard, they real because they loud and crud and they act uncivilized, violent. Nah, they cowards, fam. This showed me a whole lot about the Republican leadership. A bunch of cowards. Trump got them shook. He's the boogeyman. He's their personal boogeyman. They're scared to death that they're going to lose some votes if Trump gets on their bad side. But what just happened in the midterms should show them that they ain't necessarily going to win if Trump backs them. Trump is a liability. Interesting that that word, if you break it down, lie and ability. He has the ability to lie. Be afraid of Donald Trump? Why, I'd never. No more talk. What the ladies talking about? Yeah.